What's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. And if you've hung out here for our Dan Vask journey or others, uh, thank you for clicking on this video because we're going to check out Dan Vask covering while well, singing uh, Nessun Dorma from uh, Puccini's um, Freak, was it? Turandot, I think? I've actually never heard uh, the name of this, the, the, the play and whatnot, uh, well, the opera. I've never heard it said, so I actually have no idea how to pronounce that. And that's me being, you know, Hispanic and our base language is being the same, but whatever. There's too much light in here. Hold up. I installed these automated blinds in my sh like office shed here. And it was the hardest thing of, of my life putting these things up, by the way. I actually, I actually didn't do a good job. But, you know, we just do the best we can. So in the channel, we have now checked out uh, Luciano Pavarotti, like the OG, seeing in Nessun Dorma. I heard, you know, my dad listened to that, but I finally sat down and really listened to it and out blown away we've also checked out the home free dudes uh singing nessun dorma so why not dan vask bro and you know we'll go through a lot of them i think some of you have requested us check out some what's her name jackie ivanko or something elizabeth requested johnny Ev jackie ivanko's version so we will do that elizabeth if you're watching but today's videos uh are brought to you by pam Riker. thank you pam everyone in the in the comment section uh send your love out to pam and before we click on this, if you haven't yet, Dan's uh, YouTube channel uh, is linked down below. Go and subscribe. He is this close to a million subscribers. Let's uh, let's do this. All right, Dan. Let's see uh, how you perform in this. I know it's. I already know it's gonna be fire, dude. Like his, you can tell homie's classically trained with some of the other stuff of his that we've checked out on the channel. So I know, I know he's gonna crush it. But I hope I can hear his voice. So let's see. Yeah, bro. One of the most beautiful pieces of music written, bro. Okay, uh, my wish came true right away. I feel like he really could try to, I don't know, for lack of better words, uh, he could try to imitate uh, Pavarotti. Like, I think he, he, I think he knows how to sound pretty close to him, but he's not doing that. You can hear some of his like metal singer rasp kind of in the back there. And he's also giving us some of these like pop uh, decrescendos and everything. So this is freaking awesome to me. It doesn't matter how the song, if the song is is sung well and with care and with power when it needs, when it needs, it doesn't matter who's singing this. How do you not get the chills listening to it, right? I wish it was slightly less re reverb, actually, but who cares? He has a good taste in music, man. Here we go. Here we go. Here 
go. Here we go. Atta boy. Atta boy. Oh, man. Atta boy. Dude, he's getting kind of emotional singing it. Again, how do you not get overwhelmed singing it? I haven't heard. Nice. Yes, 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 yes. All right. I was classically trained singing for just a bit of my life, but there are some things I remember that he uh, just demonstrates so well. So again, wow. Let uh, everything you're feeling, let it flow, man, because that feels good. Enjoy this. Wow. All right. Okay. So yeah, right before this. Yep. So just in this build, build up of the belt of the the belting, right? Okay. All right. So, okay. So look at his throat. Look, look how relaxed that is. Again, this is why I know he's been trained. Well, I need to hear him. Maybe he just taught himself. I don't know. So Dan, if you ever want to stream some gaming sometime, uh, I have some questions for you, bro. Um, yeah. So look how like relaxed his, his throat is. And then you can also notice like on his face, like that's where he's feeling pressure. And that's where you're supposed to sing when you're belting these things out. Right. And again, just exudes perfect mixed voice here. Honestly, it could be all chess. He, he has an incredible, uh, he, he has an incredible range. Yeah, so look how calm, see? And how, how much he opens his mouth and lets his tongue calm down. Yeah. Okay. He's going to do it again. Okay. Okay. Oof. Jeez, bro. Puccini's such a gangster, dude. Okay. When he reached for the really high note, again, still calm throat and everything, he kind of goes down. A lot of some, like, a lot of people, when they're trying to sing super high, like, reach for it, but that's stretching out your larynx, right? So it's actually, it's going to lose a lot of power and very bad for your vocal cords and so that technique man so again like let's, let's watch the replay yeah so he just he kind of lost his voice there a little bit but he's gonna do it again man look at like that emotion he's just feeling it dude and then at the end he reaches this note kind of again he does it again Yeah, bro. Oh, man, it's so cool because, again, he's such a good, good singer. And then he does awesome music, bro. <laughs> yeah, it's a big reason we're big fans of his. Yeah, what a stud. That was fun, guys. I had a, I had a blast. Thank you, Pam, for suggesting that. All of you so, for suggesting that. Thank you, Dan. Dan's the man. Well, guys, what did you think? How did you feel your first time watching that? Comment down below. Let me know. Again, um, you know, let me know in the comments what, what you felt. Check out the description down below to find ways to support this channel. Sure. More importantly, I just want to see Dan Vasquez a million, dude. All right. Much love, everybody. Thank you guys for being here. One milli.